An image orthicon is a television tube with advantages of both the image iconoscope and the orthicon. It is one of the most perfect television tubes based on the principle of outer photoemissive effect and has already ousted the iconoscope in television tubes. The image orthicon was first described in 1946 by American scientists Rose, Weimar and Law. The image orthicon consists of three sections. One creates and transfers electric image, another is used for target communication with the help of slow electrons, and the third one for secondary electronic amplification. The first section is an image converter tube that increases sensitivity. It consists of a translucent photocathode mounted on the inside of the end wall of the tube's bulb, an accelerator and a double side target. The target is a film made of semiconductor glass. The second section of the tube works with slow electrons. It consists of an electronic beam generator, a focusing anode and a decelerating electrode. Sometimes there is also a field mesh. The generated beam is deflected by horizontal and exposure coils, forming a raster pattern on the target. The third section of an image orthicon is designed to amplify the returning part of the beam's current. It consists of five ring multiplier electrodes. A pull-up resistor is connected to the output of the last electrode. Like the first section of the tube, this one works in high-velocity scanning mode. The image orthicon is the most sensitive of all television tubes currently in use. It is stable and can work with a wide range of luminance intensities.